Hey guys, how are you? Hope you're all doing well. And I uh, thank you for joining me for this live shoulder and arm workout. I'm gonna start off with some side raises using the resistance band. Step both feet in the middle of the band. Got some cool music playing. Just throw that in there. I'm gonna start with a side raise. So keep that arm slightly bent and bring it out to the side. Let's go for about 15 reps. Knees are slightly bent. Chest is out, your back's nice and flat. And the muscle we're working here are the medial deltoids. These are the muscles that give you that width in the shoulder, okay? That shoulder cap, if you like. Hope you're all doing well, staying positive. You've all had a great breakfast. I had my banana. I haven't had any protein yet. So let's still got four more, guys. Now, if you want to engage your legs a little bit more, just bend the knees forward slightly. And as you can see, I exhale as I raise up to contract those medial delts. One more. We're going to hold there for five seconds. Two, three, four, and... From there, we're going to go into a grip valve press. So I'm going to grab hold of the 30-pound grip valves. I love these... Um, these weighted free weights and then just gonna press above our shoulders okay let's go for 12. And the great thing about this grip is that it also hits your triceps as you can see I like to squat in most of my exercises so I'm still engaging my legs Okay, Woo. now from here, this is fairly ambitious of me, we're going to go into uh, some curls. Again, these are 30 pound grip bells, keep your core nice and tight, we're going to turn it up and stretch down. Do 10 reps too, side on, just so you... You can see that my back's nice and straight, my shoulders are back. Try not to use any momentum. Just focus solely on that bicep muscle, lifting and stretching it at the bottom. Do 10 reps. Last one. Woo! Okay, we're getting the buys, the tries, everything involved here, ladies and gents. Woo. Okay, from there we are going to go into another bicep exercise. The resistance band curls. Let's go for 12. Right. Eight. As you can see, I don't swing or use any momentum at all. I just try to really isolate by lifting with my bicep and resisting on the way down. You want to resist on the downward force of the movement. That's what builds muscle as well. That slowly 
resisting against that, that downward force. Whew, okay, triceps, with the TRX in place. We're gonna step our feet back towards the door to increase the angle and thereby the resistance. All right, upper arms are alongside our head. Stretch, so drop our head down, meeting our hands and then extend to flex the triceps. Keep your abs tucked in, knees is fairly straight, so your legs are straight, your core is tight, you want to stretch those triceps as you come down and then flex them as you extend your arm up like that. Great tricep exercise that also works your core and all those other stabilizer muscles. Whew. And as you can see, I don't really count reps. I go more on feel. Oh, we're gonna do one more rep. Okay, just wanna make sure the volume is up here. All right. All right, looks good. Whew. All right. Let's get another tricep exercise in. So if you have a narrow sort of chair, hold both sides. And we're gonna drop our chest in between the handles. A neutral grip, working your triceps. Hit that back nice and flat. Resting on your toes, your heels are up. Engage more of your core. Woo. <laughs> a bit of a mono there. All right, anywhere, I would guess, from 12 to 20 reps here, guys. So for me, it's all about quality of movement and progressively building up that that lactic acid in the muscle. I don't always go to failure, but I want to feel a lot of blood pull into the muscle and chase that pump. As you can see, muscles are pumping up nicely. A lot of blood flow, feeling great. Let's move into another fantastic shoulder exercise. So grab one of these um, super bands, step in the middle of it. If you go wide, you're gonna gain more resistance. So this is hitting your front delts now as opposed to your side delts or medial delts. Squat down, lean forward a little bit. So I really want you to engage your whole body. This is what I love about utilizing the bands and the grip bells and your whole body is that you can get your whole body involved while you're isolating those individual muscles. Ah. Woo. All right, now we're gonna stop halfway and go up higher than shoulder height for eight, three, four, Five, six, stop half eight. Ha! And hold it up there for 10 seconds. Tss. Woo! I hope that was 10 seconds. Oh my God, that feels so good. Shh. We gotta get another curling, ladies and gents. I'm gonna be ambitious and shoot for a 60 pound solo oh, grip out curl. So this is kind of like a hammer curl with, with the uh, 
but take on this grip, bring it up and down. Up, you're not gonna get as much range as a normal sort of dumbbell curl three. Let's go for 10, this is 60 pounds. So basically 30 in each arm. Up, stretch, hammer curls. Oh yeah. Now, if you lean forward a little bit, you make the, diff you make the exercise more difficult. Oh, it's harder to lift. You know me, I like to make everything more difficult. It's more of a challenge. Last one. Oh. Ah. All right. Shake out those arms. Woo. Feeling good. All right, no better time than one of my signature power pose, guys. Just to open up and stretch those muscles out. Remember, right leg's back, left leg's forward. Sort of split squat out to the left. We're gonna extend our arms out diagonally. Bring your arms out like so, straight line right through the arms, flexing, flexing our shoulders isometrically. So we're gonna flex in, just to keep those buys and tries pumped. In for the buys, out for the tries. Now we're gonna switch. Now don't bend your arms, don't cave in. Right leg back, left foot forward, switch. So left arm goes down, right arm in back high. You can dip down just a little bit, just to engage the legs. Flex the buys in, and the tries on the way out. Shoulders back to contract them. One more, and oh, as you can see, posture's there, feeling great. Shake out those legs. We're gonna go do another tricep exercise. Okay, let's see. The greens, I think these are 10 pounds each. So stretch back. Double arm, grip bell, overhead tricep extensions. Oh, I'm gonna stand on the balls of my feet. So I get my calves involved and my glutes while I'm hitting my triceps. Yep. No counting reps here today, guys. Whew. Okay, I'm gonna double up on these and Get another set of side raise in. Slightly leaning forward this time. Ha! Two. Three, let's do 10. Four. Nine. Eleven, make it 11. Eight. Always go that little bit further, guys. 12. Ah. I don't know, let's just keep going. <laughs> One more. Ooh. And rest it out. All right, rear delts this time. Now for rear delts on the TRX, I'm gonna have to shorten this. Whenever you're doing TRX, make sure it's fully fastened behind the door. Shorten it a bit more. There we have it. Resting on your heels. Lean back. Oh, to increase the resistance. Fly back and come forward slowly. Fly back and bring it in slowly. Woo. So you want to resist both ways. Bend the knees slightly, squeezing back on those rear deltoids. 
Oh. Ooh, a little bit of triceps as well there too. Ah, core, legs, glutes, the whole lot. I actually like to squeeze my glutes when I'm doing this. Ah. And then pause there, just to accentuate that contraction. Two more. Oh, burning. Wow. Whoa. Amazing, amazing pump right now. We have to get another curl in, ladies and gents. Yep. We'll stick with the 30 pounders. Oh. This way. 10. So as you can see, a lot of people, they do these and they move their head, they stick their neck out, just keep everything still. Be very meditative and focused about it. The only thing that should be screaming and firing are your biceps. Yep, two more. Let's do three more. One. Oh, my shoulders are burning too. Oh, woo. I tell ya, not easy, but worth it. All right, let's just uh, stretch out those shoulders a bit. A little bit of an active stretch. Bring it in and push it out. Yep. Stretching out those lats. Oh man, the pump is real. <laughs> Just trying to break down that lactic acid. All right. Back to some triceps. This time I'm gonna go in a little narrower. In between the handles of the seat or the side supports. Now with triceps, you don't need to come all the way down, but you do need to go come all the way up to really flex those triceps at the top. So stop about here and then back up. Woo. Flex those tries. And you can see them working. Yeah. Keep that whole body straight, ladies and gents. I don't rush through any of my moves. Slow and controlled wins the race. Oh. Yep. We're going to double that up, file this resistance band through the loop of this TRX and we're going to get another tricep exercise in, overhead extensions. So left leg forward, arms, upper arms by the side of your head, don't move those upper arms, three, let's do eight on each leg, four, five, Six, two more. Eight. Oh, I hope I can get these in. Eight on the right leg. Working those tries. One, two, bring it back slow. Three, two. Embrace the burn. Six, two more. Finish strong. Tight. Oh. Yep. Let's get another side raise in. This is of less resistance than the purple one. Just both feet in between the band. About a foot apart. We're going to bring it out to the side again. Whew. All right, let's go for 12. Squat down here, activate the legs and core. Mm. 
Now, if you want to keep the tension on your delts, don't bring it all the way down. Stop about here, right? Level with your hip, and then bring it higher than shoulder height. We're going to do those for eight. Hip, higher than shoulder. Up, squat, lean forward. on each arm, what do you think guys? I don't know, I've lost a lot of stress, strength in this pandemic. Oh, maybe 75, let's try it. A 75 press, Hoppa! Okay, so this is like pushing 37 pounds, 37 and a half pounds in both arms. Whew. 10, two, Four more, seven, eight, two more. Work on the tries as well. Nine, ha, ten. Now that's a 75 pound, not bad for an old fella. Right, ha. So the great thing about that um, grip is that it's getting my my triceps in as well as my shoulders. Let's go back to a curl on the TRX guys. Using the TRX. All right, so we're gonna shorten this a little bit. Hope you've been able to join me and follow me if you don't have Exactly what I do, you can always sort of modify it. Okay, so I'm keeping my elbows high. Isolating my biceps. Bring it, bring your body weight all the way in, just using your biceps. Yep, and bring it down slow. Flex. Flex those loose to keep the back tight and straight. One more. Oh. All right. Yeah. It's feeling good. Whew, feeling very good. Let's get a... Uh, I feel like I always need to really get those uh, medial delts out, so never a shortage of side raises. Uh, I'm going to be ambitious and do 30 in each arm. Wish me luck. All right, 30 pounds in each arm. Oh, eight reps. One. Drop set, partial reps. Actually, now we'll do full reps. Four, five, six, eight, oh, ah, five more. Jesus. Oh. 
Guarda come fai a Minchia. I'll tell ya. Less is more, guys. You just keep that intensity going. You don't need as much rest between sets, but you do need to fight hard, make it hard, full range of movement, and work that muscle. And switch things up constantly. Be spontaneous, be creative. That's how you're going to get results. Yep, you sure are. Whew. Let's get another uh, press in using the 30 pound grip valves. Hop, ah, and up, 10. <clears throat> Three more. Great. Oh, good set, Farah. Ah. Yep. Woo, back into a tricep push up on the, the seat. Narrow, keep your back flat, heels up. Working those triceps. Halfway down, all the way up. Okay, I guess I'll go for about 12 to 15. set of curls in using the resistance band loop through the CRX. Alright. Oh so squat down for this one to increase the resistance. And just keep those don't drop the elbows whatever you do. Let's go for 10. Oh bring it right in. Cheating didn't hurt anyone, did it? All right, the pump is real heel. Posture's good. I'm gonna enjoy a nice breakfast after this. Turkey bacon with eggs. Maybe, oh jeez, some blueberries. So um, yeah, let's keep that going guys. Let's keep it going, rear delts. We'll cross these over. And you're just gonna, yep, squeeze that that way. Three, one leg back, flexing that calf. <clears throat> All right, let's get some face pulls in. Squeezing and drop down. I try to make the set more difficult within the set by just stepping back, dropping down, whatever it takes to make it harder. Two more. Last one. Hold for five seconds. Oh. Wow. Yep. I need a drink. Where's my water? Cheers, guys. Make sure you hydrate throughout your workout. Oh, let's get another resistance band curl in. Mm. Woo. Wide stance, 
make it harder. And this time we're gonna kind of lean down. Yep. Just switch it up, make it hard, make it creative, get the blood in the muscle. Feet are starting to kill me. Let me get it under my heels where the skin's a little tougher. Okay. Three more. Oh. Ooh, stretch it out. Good old army shake. Ooh, yeah. Stretch out those inner thighs a little bit. Oh, yeah. arms, the legs. Alright. Wow. Let's follow that up with another uh, preacher type curl. These are 10 pound dumbbells guys, so a squatted preacher curl. Let's go for 15. <clears throat> yep, the lower you go, the more you'll find. into an isometric on one side, active side raised on the other, eight to ten. of it this is how we roll so uh, don't forget tomorrow morning 10 a.m. Wednesday New York City Eastern Standard Time whole body flex with me power pose weights free equipment free whole body posing and flexing for a harder leaner body thanks for joining me today stay tuned